Hello there and welcome to Linux Studio. And uh, in this video, I will be showing you how to install Google Chrome in any of your Linux distribution. So let's get started. I don't know why, but a lot of people still struggle with the installation of Google Chrome in a Linux distribution. So it's very simple. Just go to google.com, hit enter, and uh, here you have to type Google Chrome. Just type Google Chrome and this will open the Google Chrome website. So here you can see this link download now. Just click on this link and it will open the official website of Google Chrome. The installation is very easy regardless of the distribution that you are using. So this is Ubuntu but you are free to use Linux Mint, Kali Linux, MX Linux, Elementary OS, Fedora, Red Hat, CentOS, whatever the OS that you want to use or like to use use that one so just click on this download chrome button here and this will ask you for two options one is for 64 bit dot dev file and another is 64 bit dot rpm file so now you know that ubuntu is not available for 32 bits and the chrome os is not also available for 32 bit so that means if you have a 64 bit computer then only you will be able to use Google Chrome. So the .dev file is for Debian and Ubuntu based distributions. So distributions that I have just counted like Mint OS, MX Linux, Pop OS, uh, Manzaro, Ubuntu, Debian, Elementary OS, all these OSs that use the .dev package, the Debian package and some distributions like CentOS, OpenSUSE and Fedora and Red Hat, these OSs use dot rpm package file so you have to get the rpm file but this one is ubuntu and uh, most of the distribution use debian package so it is most likely that you are using a dot dev file in your distribution so just download this file or this one and hit install this will allow you to download a package file just click save and hit ok so it is being downloaded from a google server so the downloading speed is really fast because google has their servers in all the countries most of the countries have i mean i live in india and the nearest server probably in noida or pune or mumbai or maybe bangalore so the downloading speed is really fast because the file is coming from within the country and not from any another country so just hit on this folder icon this will open up the Nautilus file explorer here is the file so you can either double click on this file okay so that is not working because it is opening the file in the archive manager so just right click and uh, go to open with different kind of application and select software install so you will get a similar option here or it will automatically open in the software center so this will open the file in the software center so this is the default software center that comes with the ubuntu and here you just have to hit install button and it will ask you for your password type in your password and uh, it will start to install it in your system it will take few seconds i think and the installation will be completed and uh, done so let me just close this window Minimize this one and go to the menu and search for Google Chrome. Okay, so this is Google Chrome. So it is asking me whether you want to make it a default browser or do you want to send some kind of a statistical data to the Google server. So here is the Google Chrome up and running in the Linux. This is Ubuntu Linux. So this is 83 version, the latest one, and uh, you can install it that way. But if you're not able to install using the software center, then you can simply right click and open up the terminal or open the terminal and cd to the folder where you have downloaded it. So this one is downloads folder. That is why it is showing here downloads. So here just type sudo then Debian package, Debian package and test i and the file name that is it's google chrome okay, let me type ls here so this is the file google chrome stable it's again sudo debian package then test i to install and google hip tab key to auto complete the file name hit enter it will ask for the password type in the password and uh, it will install the package file in your system so that way you can install the application in your system 
and if you are not very comfortable with the installation process then you can check out the guide here on the website our website that is linuxstudio.com so just visit this website and here you will find a pretty neat and complete guide on how to install different kind of application in your linux distribution so this is the website here just type to you have to type installation guide and just click on this post here and uh, uh, this post has everything that you may need to know for example how to install using command line or repository how to use dot dev on dot rpm or source code for that fact to install any application how to use software center how to use dot app image file so for example we are we are using dot dev and dot rpm package so just go down below here and uh, here you can see this is the guide installing application using package file so you can download different kind of package file using this website then if the package file is a dot dev file so this is to install dot dev file you have to type sudo dev in package dash i and path to the package file and if it's a dot rpm file then you have to type sudo dfn so this is the package manager for fedora or open sushi and then local install and then the package file name and that way you can install the package file in a system so this is pretty easy to understand guide so that way you can learn how to install applications in a linux distribution so that was it in this video on how to install google chrome on your linux and if you liked it then don't forget to hit that thumbs up subscribe to the channel for more and i'll catch you in the next one till then take care and keep enjoying linux